Today on the channel, I get lost. Hopefully, we're going the right way. There's all the carbs around, look at them. <laughs> Go in search of a certain blue trail. That was so cool. We hit some big jumps on a rebuilt downhill track. Woo! That was dope. <laughs> Here's this wooden piece of thing. We fly into it. Hell yeah. In last week's video, we headed down to Tambrook and Bike Park and did some shuttles. A somewhat unknown bike park with some nuts gap jumps and wild steeps. Also, my mate Jack hit the deck pretty oh, hard. Yeah. Oh shit! You sure you're good, bro? Just yeah. wait, just wait. In this week's <laughs> video, I travel down to Hidden Vale solo. And I'm on the XE bike. Today I'm searching for a trail I did out here on my first ever ride at HVAP. About two years ago. And the trail is called Scree, and for whatever reason, I have it in my head that this trail is really fun, so the search is on the find it. After we find Scree, I'm going to hit the jumps on the long rebuilt trail called Treatum. I'm doing what I call is a super loop, which is about 30k return. So let's go. Starting off at the skills park, which is about 2k's from the car park. Moving along, I follow Western Creek. <laughs> that is what I need to drop and see. Some more steps. Sick. <laughs> Continuing on to Big Dam, and here's where I get lost. Move. Move. Yeah, bull. You're a big dog. I was meant to go right after Big Dam, but I continued on to the newly built Dancing with Dingoes. Oh, I know nothing about this trail. I think it said it was a green. I haven't seen a go in in ages. Look at him. I hope I'm not scaring him too much. Damn, he's a big dog. Big fella. Stay there, bro. Don't jump on me. At least not for me on Telstra. Holy shit, that was a big brown. Ooh. Oh, oh. Seen him the last minute, he just took off. Oh, damn. Big brown snake. Then backtracked along the fire road. So I'm in search of Scree. The problem with chasing this trail is there is no climb trail to get there. So I have to push up this horrid fire road. It's not really that steep, but well, there is sections that are steep. Like, this isn't that steep. But I've already... Put in about 15 k's, so kind of feeling it. After the fire road, I jumped onto Serenity and then onto Chinese Whispers. The trails get super rocky from this side of the park, and I really enjoyed Chinese yeah, Whispers. Climb by looks, which is exactly what I was expecting. Oh, some rock slabs. They're good. Rock slab. Oh, yeah. Finally, we are on to Scree, and straight away I met with a sick little rock drop, and I had to go back Hell up and yeah. do it. I didn't think Scree was this close. Looks like you could. Looks like you could ride along that up there. I might go back and do that. That's so cool. <laughs> oh, the rock. Ooh. Furthering along Scree, it continues to be a rocky trail with some tricky features. I would recommend riding this trail, although I was exhausted at this point, I still really I enjoy this want. trail. These rock slides. <laughs> I don't know why they're so fun, but they are. <laughs> the half of my cliff bar. Oh, God. Oh, shit. Bit of a bad line. <laughs> oh, yes, some more rock slide. <laughs> Had a down clip there. Looking right off that. 
Yeah. Oh. You can, I just smashed my nuts pretty bad on the seat. Oh. This is a lot of work. <laughs> we have done it. <laughs> we have done scree. From the top of scree, I head down the fire road and jump on the Treatum. This trail starts next to one of the main trails, Divine. Treatum was recently built and redone with some new jump features and some wooden bits. Let's jump into Treatum. This trail isn't a part of the uh, high five shuttles. I reckon it should be. It's as good as um, Divine, I reckon now since the upgrade. So fun. What is this? Another trail I wanted to do out here was popping rocks. But after I just finished climbing Scree and Chinese Whispers and the other trails I've done today, I just don't think I'd be able to do that much up and down. Nice. <laughs> Oh, that's a double I wouldn't have cleared. I don't have the speed for that. <laughs> Hell yeah. Whee! <laughs> that turned into something bigger than it looked. <laughs> a jump there. A little double. Sick. Oh yeah, here's a little hip, hip jump. Phew! That was dope. <laughs> Here's this wooden feature thing. We fly into it. Hell yeah. Tabletop. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, good. This is towards the bottom now. Big double. Tabletop and that's it. Treat them. Next up, I decided to push my body limits and ride the long way out. Heading up and down Yowie and jumping off halfway and accidentally riding plateaued I think backwards, I'd be able to pedal up that. which was actually pretty fun. Ooh. For some reason, my neck's pretty sore. Genuinely, my neck doesn't feel sore or stiff when I ride. This rock section's sick. Finishing plateau, I get straight into Snappy Turtle and follow it into Trailer Thrash. Sick. How cool is that? Oh, that's a rock. Oh, that is wild. <laughs> Man, look at this. A little high line. Woo! Oh, yeah, a little jump. Big. <laughs> you got some good air off of that. Sleep and burns. Big table. Oh, it's rough. Very rough. Big table. Huge burns. Yeah. <laughs> From the end of Trailer Thrash, it's a small climb up Ferry oh, Ren. W R E N. <laughs> There's still a few switchbacks to go. And then straight into plane sailing, a fast chill trail to finish the loop. See, so this trail is still a bit pedally, but it's fast and. Mostly downhill. A little roller. Nice. Crossed over the fire road. That fire road looks new. Fun. Great way to end the day. So, in today's ride, I did over 30 k's. This loop was filled with big climbs and solid descending, and overall, a really fun loop. 
Check out Hidden Vale Adventure Park's website for more info about the place, or check out the video on the left hand of the screen right now. Cheers, legends.